A very cute mutt has put a whole new meaning to the phrase, it's time for a walk. Our resident veterinarian, Dr. Debbie Turner-Bell, has this amazing story. Good morning. Good morning. Well, you know, prosthetics with animals is not actually new, but there is an exciting new technique that has given a three-legged dog a fourth leg and a new life. You were such a good boy today. At first you know, glance, Cassidy yeah, looks like an ordinary dog on a walk. I love you. Until you take a closer look. Then you see his brand new high-tech artificial leg. We decided to do the in implant June of 07. When Stephen and Susan Posofsky adopted Cassidy from a New York City shelter in 2005, he was already missing his right hind leg. Getting him a leg was not even in my thoughts at the time. It was just to save a dog. But missing a leg was taking a toll on the German Shepherd mix. So you can see that his posture, I mean, is, is it was really hard for him. So the Posovskis found veterinary orthopedic surgeon Dr. Dennis Marcelin Little at the North Carolina State University College of Veterinary Medicine. We worked for about a year first to try to design uh, an external brace that was fairly sophisticated and uh, but did not work very well. There were two removable legs made for him. Right. Slip-on legs which he was able to just kick off. At that point they took out some computer di diagrams and said, let's look into this possibility of an osseous integrated leg. That's a good boy. Cassidy's artificial leg is a permanent prosthetic, literally a part of his body. A titanium rod was implanted into Cassidy's tibia or lower leg bone. Over several months, Cassidy's own bone fused to the titanium rod. Then a custom-designed carbon fiber foot with a rubber tread for traction screws right onto the implant. Now he walks for two, three hours and not a hint of fatigue in Look his what life. I got. Watching him run on the beach, okay. it's been a very emotional thing for me personally. Uh, I got you. Let's go. But a lot of tears of joy. Oh, it's so neat to watch. Well, Cassidy's new guy was a collaboration between Dr. Marshall and Little and the engineering department at NC State. It took 14 months of planning, trial and error before they finally fit a leg that would fit Cassidy permanently. Wow. Isn't that, is, that nice? It's a good story. Debbie, thank you so much.